हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू ऑल आई एम चंदन कुमार प्रधान वेलकम टू दिस चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस कंजर्वेटिव नेचर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रोस्टैटिक फील्ड लेट्स एगेन व्हाट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ कंजर्वेटिव फील्ड ए फील्ड इज सेट टू बी कंजर्वेटिव व्हेन इफ वी कैलकुलेट द वर्क डन इन दैट पर्टिकुलर फील्ड इफ दैट वर्क डन is independent of the path followed but depend upon the initial and final points then that field is said to be conservative if exactly that thing happened in case of electrostatic field then we can say that field is conservative in nature so here to show that let uh, consider a test charge q not which is placed in space that test charge q not is placed in space at point p which is at position vector r vector in an electric field there will be the existence of electric field let the electric field acting on that of test charge q not at point p b e e vector that is the electric field acting on the test charge on the test charge q not at point p then the electrostatic force on that of test charge will be then the electrostatic force electrostatic force on test charge q not is equal to q not is given by that is uh, force electrostatic force on the test charge q not that is denoted by f e is equal to that is charge into electric field q not into e here the electrostatic force is applied here the direction f e is equal to q not into e in order to hold that charge q not in that particular position there will be the application of the force which is equal and opposite to that of electrostatic force in order to take that q not at point p here we have to apply the force external force f which is equal and opposite that force is same as that force but opposite in direction in that of figure that not clearly shown but you can imagine that force is same and opposite to that external force that's why that q not as in that point p 
here the external force F is equal to minus F E which is equal to minus Q naught E equal and opposite. Here we write in order to hold this charge in position we have to apply external force which is equal and opposite to that electrostatic force to electrostatic force therefore the external force external force applied is equal to F minus of electrostatic force which is equal to minus Q naught into E. Now, we have to calculate the work done to move the charge. Let the test charge is given a small displacement. Let that is the path let I use at point A and point B. The test charge taking a small displacement that displacement section let D L D L be the small displacement then the work done due to that small displacement will be force F dot D L here we write let the test charge is given small displacement small displacement DL then the work done due to that external force then the work done due to that external force that is dw equal to f dot dl fdl or dw in place of that force we substitute q naught into e minus q naught e dot dl now we have to calculate the work done moving the test charge q naught from the point a to point b along that path let that path is named as c you have to calculate therefore the work done the work done in moving the test charge test charge that is q naught from point A to point B along the path C along the path C is given by and the total work done W 
a b work done in moving the test charge q naught from the point a to b that w a b that is integration over d w from the point a to b or w a b is equal to that of minus q naught e dot d l so minus q naught e dot d l from a to b look at that particular integration means that work done is depend upon the initial and final points not the path followed means if the path from a to b look like this or any path look like this then each cases the work done will be same that's why here the work done is independent of the path here we conclude that that work done this work done is independent of the path followed but depend upon the initial and final points that's why that's why that electrostatic field is said to be conservative that electro static field is said to be conservative said to be conservative as we define the conservative field is that field in which the work done is independent of path followed but depend upon the initial and final points here that work done is independent of path followed as you derived but depend upon the initial and final points that's the way we can say the electrostatic field is conservative in nature so with the help of this video lecture we understand the conservative nature of electrostatic field we take a test charge in space with the apply of electrostatic field electrostatic force is applied here and that force can be balanced by applying an external force which is equal and opposite in that of direction and small work done due to the displacement of that of charge we calculate the small work done finally the total work done due to moving the test charge q naught from point a to b is calculated here that expression indicates the work done is independent of path followed but to depend upon the initial and the final points that's the basic region on that basic point we define or we can say the electrostatic field is conservative in nature so with this useful and infinite notes let me wind up this session thank you